do you have, um, and this is my, my last question on this sort of subject, but I know there's a lot of startups there, and it is always one of the things that they're concerned about, especially when they see Facebook, say, knocking off every feature every startup does and just making it part of the product and absolutely having no conscience about it. So I sort of feel like Google is a much better citizen, you know, infinitely better citizen compared to, to Facebook uh, in that regard. Um, but are there, is there a standard that is like, you know, the Google standard of how to behave with partners and handle this? Or is it just a, a sort of philosophy inside the company? Exactly. I think it comes with a philosophy and culture and mindset. Yeah. Uh, we think about partners. Google got where it got because the partner and Absolutely. building yeah. uh, on the ecosystem and playing nicely uh, with everyone. And it's just part of the culture. It's when you go in, when I go in and do a, a product, I know that to succeed, we need partners, right. and I know that the best user experience will be with partners. So I, I think, it, again, it's not like top level down guidelines. It's yeah. you just ingrain it through the culture and just understanding how Google yeah. operates. Nobody says, oh, you have to give this much real estate to them. Right. 60, rule number seven says this. Right. It's just be good to the partners. Right. Um, so let's talk a little bit about being an entrepreneur inside of Google. Mm -hmm. uh, here you are on This Week in Startups mm -hmm. uh, and talking about your product freely, talking about a controversial issue like partners and the relationship between them. Um, is Google uh, changing a little bit in that regard and maybe letting the people building products inside of it talk about their products? Uh, and how, how is the PR process in, in Google changing these days? Um, I wouldn't say necessarily there are significant changes. I think Google has always let people represent the product and talk about it. There is a move to I think let people be more autonomous. And Google does understand at the end of the day if they want to retain great talent and uh, really have that bottom up innovation. We need to inspire entrepreneurs. We need to motivate them. We need to allow them a venue to actually get their ideas executed, to build a team, and to get the message out in a very genuine and direct way. So I think yeah. that's, that's part of that. So you, when I asked you guys to be on the program, I emailed yeah. Karen and whatever. It's no big deal now. Like, just hey, come, sure, come and talk. And I think it's a, a great uh, philosophy. No big deal. And I mean, even for me as a product manager, this is part of me understanding the ecosystem, how partners react. Yeah. I'll go on blogs and just directly comment on the for the bloggers on what they think about the product. Just have a conversation. Yeah. We need to have the conversation for the ideas to flow in, for the ideas to flow out. You know, it's not, not have like a big yeah. wall separating those. You've been watching This Week in Startups. To watch the full episode, click here. To check out some other shows from This Week in, click here.